down dirty dog always wanting to have two women on you now i understand going along with this little charade until steffi gets a little bit stronger but playing into it like you are saying there's no place i'd rather be and saying i love you nah you are leading her on you are a low down dirty dog who still wants both women and it's not right at all welcome back to my channel guys and welcome to another bold and a beautiful review I can already see that this storyline is going to work my last nerves. But come along for the ride with me. Take a minute to like the video and let's get into this review. Please, I, uh, I'd like some time alone with my daughter and my, my husband. So you like me to go? Um, no, but I'll be out there in a minute. Is it just me or does Liam seem a little too eager to go along with the charade? Nobody is coaxing him into it. He's going in there and he's all in. So Steffi did remember Kelly today and I was wondering how that was going to work because I was sure Kelly was going to mention Hayes, but that did not happen today. I guess we'll see what happens tomorrow. But he brought her to her and you can see that Steffi was visibly shocked by how big Kelly was. So she really has gone back into a time probably to when um, she and Liam just had Kelly when she was a baby. And I think JMW is doing a great job with this role. She's very believable. Um, the shock on her face when Kelly walked in the room, and Kelly is just adorable. I love it. She is so cute. But I don't, I don't like how everyone else is handling this situation, namely Taylor and Ridge and Liam. And my heart goes out to hope because she has to be thinking Liam just recently cheated on her with Steffi. Remember, they had to have a paternity test for Hayes. So that is still very fresh. And now we're getting into a situation where Steffi could be going home and Liam could be going to stay there to keep the charade up. And if we're going to play this out, let's think about it. So what's going to happen to Hayes? Are they just not going to tell him that Hay tell her that Hayes exists? Or are they going to pretend like Hayes is her child with Liam? Or will Sheila offer to keep Hayes? And of course, Taylor will go along with it since that's her new bestie. Maybe she needs to be with her son. Or what about if somebody comes to visit? What are you gonna tell them? Don't mention Finn? Come on. I know that you don't want her recovery to have any setbacks. I get that. But this is crazy. No, this is crazy that you're not seeing that taking that away from her would be devastating for her recovery. Steffi has, has, has blocked out all of her memories of Finn and she's turned to Liam. Taylor is acting like it's not problematic that Steffi is turning to Liam and Brooke used the word fixated on him. And I kind of agree with that. Taylor took issue with that. But the way she's staring at him and rubbing on his arm and my husband, my husband, I do feel like a fixation is um, developing there. And Taylor is acting like this is perfectly normal. There's nothing wrong with it. She even said earlier that she's wondering if these strong feelings um, is because Steffi never truly got over Liam and she was suppressing those feelings. So I would think that would be red flags right there. But no, I feel like she's on the inside rooting for Steffi and Liam to get back together since Steffi has lost her husband, which is completely messed up considering that she knows that Liam is married to Hope and Hope is being so understanding. It is too soon and it is too dangerous. I will not allow it. Don't do this. Don't make this an issue for us. I'm not the one making it an issue, Rock. Really? You're not using this situation to drive a wedge between Hope and Liam? Because I think you are. So do you agree with Brooke here? Do you feel that Taylor is using this to try to drive a wedge between Hope and Liam to ultimately get Steffi a new husband? I, I don't know. I guess time will tell. Part of me says, I think it may be happening. It could be that she's just worried about her daughter 
and she just doesn't want to press her too quickly. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. But that was the bulk of the show today. The other scene that stood out was with Ridge and Sheila. Ridge told Sheila, you're not going yet. Like he really wants her out of here. See, I told you, Sheila thought that for some reason, if she got Ridge and Taylor back together, he would magically like her. No, not even her saving Taylor's life is changing his opinion of her. He is still very skeptical as he should be. But he basically told her once again to hit the road and he'll let her know if anything happens with Steffi. But that's it, guys. Thanks for watching the video. I feel like this storyline is going to be very frustrating. I really hope it doesn't drag on. And on the note of Sheila, it seems like she wouldn't want to be around the hospital because I think seeing Sheila could actually trigger Steffi's memory. So I'm hoping that happens any day now so we don't have to struggle on through this storyline. Anyway, like I said, thanks for watching. Please take a moment to like the video, share, and subscribe.